Oh, you are not fooling anybody with that comb over, sir. I'm gonna ignore you for a second. My dudes. What's going on with the item? Taking this thermos procedures. Let's take a look at that first. <laughs> All right, containment procedure. No, no unique procedures required. Altered status is suspected but unverified. Uh, description altered effect. Blue th coffee thermos with a white plastic cap and the logo of Oh Dear Diner. Oh, I want to go to somewhere that's like Oh Dear Diner. Located in Bright Falls, Washington, the cap doubles as a mug. Item responds to formula, is it formula 116, yet no discernible altered effect has been discovered other than keeping liquids warm for a surprisingly long period of time. It's almost like it's a thermos. It's also worth noting that the coffee from the third is always refreshing and strong no matter its quality being poured into the item. Oh, before being poured. <laughs> it's the perfect thermos. Uh, thermos was discovered on the shore of Cauldron Lake outside the town of Bright Falls. Both are known sites of recurring AWEs. I think that's Altered World Events. Uh, according to witness statements, Alan- <gasps> Alan Wake! Oh! Okay, I was wondering why that sounded familiar. Okay, this is cool. Oh, all right, this makes perfect sense. The thermoses were uh, collectible items in Al in the Alan Wake game, which is a game I do want to get around to playing one of these days. Oh, this is even better. Wait, isn't this the same? Is this the same company who did Alan Wake? Oh, I can't remember now. Who went missing shortly before the discovery of the thermos has been seen blank collecting similar thermoses for a uh, blank purpose. Oh, Artemis, look at that little owl! Oh, that's so cute! It's got a little hat! Oh, I think it's a hat, right? Looks like a hat. Or a little flower crown. I did not know they were gonna have a reference to Alan Wake. This is perfect. I love it. Alright. Wolf Globe. Uh, no unique procedures required, however, contact should be limited as some report feeling disoriented after touching it. Do not touch. Item is handmade, set in dark wood. The item itself is lacquered, hand-painted, spins freely on all axes. Uh, while the continents and oceans are recognizably those of Earth, careful examination has revealed numerous blank and other geo geographical additions that do not exist on our planet. What? That's cool. One of these islands has a city marked on a name, Tan Relo. Or Relio? Uh, there are no signatures left by its maker. Physical contact renders subjects dizzy and disoriented like you were spinning it. Uh, with some report of feeling an unfamiliarity with their surroundings. This effect seems to grow worse with prolonged contact, culminating in a sense of listlessness and depression. Suicide has been observed in blank hand. Don't touch it. Sorry, just taking a quick drinky drink there. Remember, stay hydrated. Uh, Mo Remedy Entertainment made both Alan Wake and Control. Gotcha. All right. Because I'm like, were they just kind of paying homage or homage or what have you to Alan Wake? But now it makes it makes more sense. Oh, it's a flower crown. Okay. That's so cute, though. A little flower crown on the owl. All right, let's talk to this comb over dude. I'm not going to be able to take you seriously, sir. Just shave it and call it a day. Is there something I can help you with? A comb? The new director. I need to get inside. New director? Right. Uh, well, okay. Hello, I'm Frederick Langston, the Panopticon supervisor. It's not the best time for a tour. We have hiss everywhere, numerous cell breaches, and system failures across the board. And apparently no mirrors. the director, so here we go. Founded by Zachariah Trench, the Panopticon is our... My predecessor. For all altered I don't have time for this. Give me the short, short version. kept here. Can you help me find him? Faden. Uh, sure. Darling wanted him somewhere secure. Darling. He's away from people. He's in the maximum security cells, upper level. But there's currently a, uh, a pressing matter. Everything is pressing at this moment. In there. <laughs> it's is it the mug? TV. It's, uh, it's a real doozy. Oh, wait, it's a TV? Salvador took a team in to handle it, but no one's heard from them for Oh, I don't think Salvador made it. This is a category 5 OOP we're talking about. If you don't contain it soon, it will tear the pen off to con apart. And we don't want all those altered items getting loose, man. Oh, but now they're all mine. 
They belong to me. Dylan's in there. Open the door, Langston. I'm going in. If you say so. I do. Uh, I usually tell first timers not to touch anything. Oh, I'm gonna touch everything. Here, I'll get the door for you. <laughs> Mo, donate some hair. You have I do have enough hair. Just cut off my ponytail. Just set it right on top of his head. Subdue the Ben Benikoff Benikoff TV object of power. Fourth floor. Wait, who's talking? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Um, okay. Oh. It's like, dude, you're not fooling anybody. Just just shave it. Call it a day. It's fine. You'd probably rock it with a bald look. Alright, watch. I'm watching my step. The panopticon. As, as it says. But that object of power might wreck this place before I find him. I love the giant letters. It'd be even more humorous if, like, only Jesse could see these giant letters. Alright, it's now my hot spot zone here. <laughs> Mo, museum, don't touch anything. Sam, just sweat, just looking around. It's like, what you thinking about? Just touching everything. The forbidden touches. It's like, look at that painting, I have to touch it. It's like, I need to know the texture. It's like, do I want to head down there first or cross? Oh, let's go cross. What could possibly go wrong? Look at this waist high cover. All these things I can pick up. <gasps> Dead body! All right, you've come in handy. Even in death, you are serving me. Oh, I don't like you floaty dudes. You get out. Don't like you. There we go. See, I prefer to throw things at my enemies than relying on my gun. Uh, let's see. Oh, Artemis, you almost shaved your hair back to a mohawk again. Wait. You almost shaved your hair back to a mohawk again today. Oh, that'd be so cool. Like a mohawk or like a faux hawk? Or like an undercut. Oh, that's so cool. Mo, you shaved your head and... <laughs> oh, you had Keanu Reeves' hair. It'll grow back. Had to shave it at some point, I guess. Especially like with the summer coming up with the heat and everything. That, that I figure, is the perfect time to get a short haircut. Short hairdo. Alright, well, what's down here then? Oh, it's like nothing! Possible fight zones. And a deadly drop, but at least, hey, at least they have handrails. They're OSHA compliant. Alright, floor number one. I think they said I had to go floor number two. Yep, floor four. Ooh, goodies. Gimme. Give Gimme give these goodies. They're now mine. Yes. I'm gonna hold, I'm gonna hold on to you. I'm gonna take you with me. I'm gonna let you go. Be free. That's a mailbox, right? Yeah, that's a mailbox. What are you doing? Oh, you're just videotaping the mailbox. Can I get in? I want to touch it. I need to mail something. It's priority. Uh, Artemis, a long mohawk. Ah, mohawk. <laughs> Mo. You're here all week. Tip your waitress. It's a basket. Oh, it'd be horrible if I just tipped. Alright, you're free, basket. Go. Be free. I cannot get in the door. I wonder if I turn back around. Now it's fine. So floor one, unit 15. A rotating fan. Cannot get through. Let's 
Is that a sledgehammer? Yes. Can I get through? All right. Oh, huh. What was here? I need to know. It's secrets. AI can- what? AI containment? I thought you weren't allowed to have, like, really high-tech items in this center, in this building. Because it freaks out. Alright, well, did I investigate everything? I'm just gonna do a quick double check. Just to make sure I did not miss anything on the other side. I don't think there was anything I missed. I think, yeah, the door was shut. Yeah, that's a no-go. This is a no-go. Don't you look at me. Don't look at me. Meanwhile, who's ever watching the security devices and cameras and everything like that, they're like, this new director's nuts. Alright, time to go. Uh, well, I'm already on number one. Let's go number four. Something went wrong with the Bureau's plan to make Dylan a nice director. Marshall made it sound like it was all Dylan's fault, but how much of it was what the Bureau did to him? Yeah, capturing kids to make them your future director and boss probably isn't a good or wise investment. Oh, I see you, dude. Oh, oh, oh God! <laughs> I can't even shoot. Go away. I have no line of defense or offense. Oh, well. Hmm. Ooh, goodies. Give me these goodies. Give them to me. What does this say? Oh wait, hold on. Safety notice. Open only one containment locker at a time. I can do what I want. You can't tell me what to do. And again, number three is blanked out. It's like, I'm the boss. You can't boss me around. I'm the boss. Ooh, there's nothing in there. Cannot go. I know there's a floaty dude around here somewhere. There's a dude here! He's just watching a fridge! A really old fridge. Hello? What are you doing in there? Oh, thank God! <laughs> Someone has to watch this object at all times, or it deviates. What? This is a place we've never shown up. Yeah, probably because everyone's dead. I can't. I'm sorry. There's an emergency. I'll come back, I promise. Will I? Okay, just. Don't forget. I oh. Fridge, dude. You know what? I'm gonna do this. Dylan can wait. This fridge is now taking over my my concentration right here. Oh, Philip, I have a bad feeling. You will not be here when I come back. <laughs> can I talk to you again? No. Ooh. Oh, I cannot go through this door. It's a shame I have, like, no way of contacting Comb Over Dude. Instantly I forget the dude's name, but I think it's, like, Langston? But it's just Comb Over Dude. Alright, let me... Do this. Uh, Mo, this gives me CSP, Containment Breach vibes. Wait, does this game have anomalous objects and creatures? I guess, if you want to consider this. Consider them ano anomalous. Oh, there's nothing in there. Or at least maybe there is something in there. I just can't see it. Uh, I mean, there's the hiss. There's the mold. There's floaty dudes. There's altered items. Yeah, before I go, before I go too far. <gasps> Knew it. Something's attacking me. Time to bail. Sorry, Philip. I will be right back. Oh, the music's kicking off. I don't like that. Hold on. There's people out there shooting at them. I think I need to go help them. Alright, fridge afterwards. I'll be back, Philip. 
Hold on tight. Don't go anywhere. Oh, and they have shields too. Come on, recharge. There we go. Dude, oh, I saved them. Or at least I did not hang around and watch them die. I was not completely incompetent. Are you guys okay? You're just NPCs. You're fine. You're cool. Uh, Mo, you might want to give this game a go. I mean, I'm enjoying it. I actually, I don't know how far along I am in this game. But I would recommend it. I think it was like $30 when I got it. Ooh, I can get another point. I don't want to go too far. Because I need to help Fridge Dude. But I wanted to make sure that these people were okay. You guys alright? You good? A nice green color, nice friendly color there. All right, I'm gonna go see if I can help Philip. I wanna go back to comb over, dude. I guess I could fast travel, but I'm gonna it just it was just a quick, quick head down the elevator, walk across the bridge, and then I'm back there. Uh, Mo, you're reading the wiki on Control, and it says the game is inspired by the fictional SP S SCP Foundation. <laughs> SCP Foundation, that's like the creepypasta stuff, right? I just to make sure I'm not mis misremembering what SCP is. Because I remember seeing, like, I've watched uh, when they were still on the Super Best Friends and they would have their Halloween specials and they had one which I think was SCP Containment Breach. Where it's like, it was this monster that you had to keep an eye on and you had to blink. So it's like you had to make sure that you could blink in an area where the monster wasn't there. Is that the same thing I'm thinking of? Okay, uh, Mo, yes. Alright. Ooh, I picked up material. Nice. Okay, so I could have just warped back, but... Comb over, let me in. Let me in, it's too slow. Dude, I found a dude. Let me talk to you. Dude, I found a dude. Is the TV back in its box yet? No, but I found a fridge. It's just, you know, an ongoing concern. Uh, let's see. Where's the fridge? How do I help him? Oh wait, hold on. Assist a uh, fridge duty. Assist the agent in the Panopticon cell after Dylan has been found. Oh, see, I cannot read, but now at least I can ask this guy stuff. Looking at the FBC. Sure. I mean, yeah, the drama is a bit much, but I get. That. You know, the drama, like being possessed by an otherworldly entity. Yeah, it's fine. That's not to say I don't like my job, ma'am. Been here over 15 years. No one knows the Panopticon collection better than me. I'm, uh... Seniority? Most of them, in a way. Oh! That's creepy! Be or normal here. That's, that is creepy. <laughs> They're my children. It depends on the item. You sing to them at night. Like the fridge, you gotta stare at it. Go a long way. Singing to them. Did he say singing? I was joking about singing! It's not superstition if it works. Uh, let's see. Oh, Mo SCP stands for Secure Containment or Contain Project or Protect. Oh, see, I can't read. <laughs> Basically, anomalous items, places, creatures made by fans, uh, but they have to be licensed. And there's over oh six thousand. Jeez. There's a wall clock that's filled with beans, and it gives compliments to people. Yeah, so it's kind of like that. Like, I'm finding items that give me powers. Think of them like storms. So, like, I found a horse that used to be on a carousel. 
They're big. And it gave me superpowers. Of course, directors can just bind the OOP and become the eye of the storm. Altered items are more like weird thunderstorms. Some may rain frogs, some may rain corn, but they all rain something. Do they rain men? Hallelujah. Is it raining men? Making them aggressive. Now they're all raining, I don't know, knives. Knife rain. <laughs> nice metaphor. Sharp, pointy rain. Uh, what about my predecessor, who totally shot himself? Oh, he spent Still don't know why. Darling. Circle. Not that I care. Oh, it's a boys club. He had his favorites. He did stop in occasionally to scowl. <laughs> Did you know the Bureau has a no-smoking policy? No, considering I've seen cigarette machines here. Still, he is the one who put aside funding for the panel. Generic brand cigarettes. The man did have vision. Uh, what's, what's your background, sir? What are your qualifications? Why should I keep you on? Started as a junior agent because my uncle knew a guy. Back when you knew had hair. Desk until an accident left the containment sector severely. The accident. I got pumped up to management. Put in a steady eight hours a day for another ten years, and voila, supervisor. <laughs> this dude's like just picked up a gun. Yeah. Or a gun picked me. The gun chose me. I didn't choose the gun. The gun chose me. All right, enough, dude. See you later, Langston. I'll be here, like always. Wait, hold on. Somebody's talking. Or they were. All right, that's it. Nice. I could warp. You know, I am gonna warp. Why run when you can teleport? Ooh, I have abilities. Uh, Mo, alright, you're gonna go. Have a good night. Thank you again, Mo. Hope you have a good evening. Have a good night. See you next time. I may stream again tomorrow, possibly during the the early portion of the day because I cannot stay up late tomorrow night because of my job on Monday. We'll catch you again next time. But yes, I would definitely recommend this game if you're interested. Uh, if you're still kind of on the fence, probably rent before buy. All right, I have one, I have one point to spend. That is not enough for anything. Ooh, can I make a new gun? I can make new guns. I can upgrade my guns. I do not have enough material for some of these. Do I even have pier? I must have this pierce to be able to upgrade it. Hmm. Let's upgrade. You know, I'm gonna hold off on upgrading because I use the spin more often than I use basically anything. Oh, I don't want to- wait. Could I collect reward? Yes. Yes, I can. Okay, I don't want to abandon. Let's see. Ba, ba, ba. Am I in the maintenance sector? I don't remember where I am. Let's just accept this. Okay. Oh, wait, wait. I'm supposed to teleport. <laughs> that quickly. Upper Panopticon. Oh, nice. I thought I had to go through a load screen. Oh, wait. Fridge Duty, you still here? I did go and get help. I'm sorry. They- I have to- I cannot get help yet. I have to find my brother. Brother first. Bros before fridges. Oh, what was that? Oh, whoops. I accidentally shot something. I didn't realize I was gonna shoot and then I didn't realize it was gonna explode. Whoops. Now that seems very unsafe. Alright, can I move this body? No, I think that's a stationary body that has to stay there. Right. Ooh, yes, mods. Gimme, gimme. Gimme these mods. Oh. Alright, well, time to clean out a bit. Personal mods. Let me just take a quick peeky peek here. Uh, I have 15%. This is 13. But I'm going to deconstruct this. 
15, 13, 10, get rid of this, 17, get rid of that, 6, 6, go, that's good, but I think it was a weapon mod. I think I'm all full with these mods, but let's see, 81, 30, wait. Damage against enemy armor, plus 81%, 32 per, uh, we're getting rid of 32. Let's see, exclusive to shatter, get rid of that one. Exclusive to spin, am I have, do I have spin? I have that gripped? I think I do. 15, let's get rid of that. Let's get rid of that. It's 41%. Eight, whoa. Energy gain from headshots. Oh, it's a different, it's a different mod. Okay. Let's take a look at the spin. So I have rate of fire 34%. Accuracy. Damage after a kill. Headshot. Accuracy. Oh, but this is exclusive to spin. Okay. Energy gain from headshots, rate of fire. Hmm. Since I use this gun more frequently than I do anything else, it may help me to damage against enemy armor since I'm coming up against more enemies that do have armor equipped. There we go. And then I'm hoping I'll be able to unlock the second mod spot. All right, I have four open spaces there. I have seven there. Corrupted sample. All right, shatter projectile choke. Oh, let's check this side just, just in case. Nope, nothing hidden. Twisted Passage. That's the object of power. Is it? To cleanse it. Out, out, damn spot. That's the TV. Okay. Please put me in like a cartoon or like an advertisement. Oh, this is cool. I have no control over this, but this is cool. Is a little different than the previous objects I've touched. Because typically they take me to that, like, zone. The different astral plane. No, come back, TV! Alright, subdue the TV. Alright, look. Uh, assist the agent. Oh! This is some uh, optical illusion thing here. This is nice. I like it. Is it Escher? Is that the artist? Whoop. Oh, nice. I was worried I was going to fall. Alright, well, let's take a looky loo around here. I don't trust any of you. Do I have to go down there or do I have to go up here? It's almost like I need to follow it. So let's see, how far can I go? Can I follow it? Alright. 